Yep, it's counting. All right. This is the old apple tree, and this is a sucker. So we're going to graft my dad's apple onto it. So I'm just going to get rid of this branch right here. Yeah, that sounds good. Again, I'm going to put this side above where I'm cutting so it doesn't ruin the bark like it did last time. Watch out, this one's... Slice. Work on this side did really well because that's where I came in at. I'm just gonna. Again, the bottom one might not survive, but that's alright. I'm just gonna go in. Hopefully, Grandpa doesn't see me. so we can accept the wedge. Get it ready. That's good. All right. We're going over to the branch I chucked off. Just grabbing a couple of starts. Come down about three. Line up the bark. Show it to him. Yeah, show them the other part. Just need a wedge. What other part? Oh, the, the tip. part that's growing. Yeah. yeah. Usually I don't like them to have leaves already, but that's all right. It's a little okay. late to be doing grafting. What is it, the end of March now? Last day. Last day of March. And then see, you're just lining up the outside with the bark so it'll get some nutrients. Pretty much we've given this branch no other choice but to feed these branches. So I think both of these should survive. Get them down in there somewhat tight. I like to spread it apart a little bit. Shove them down in. And pull it. Oh, that was perfect.
moisture just so it doesn't dry out I guess So you just cut some off of the bag so it wasn't so big? Yeah. Okay. You don't want it hanging down all over the place. This one's going to be kind of interesting. My dad used to just spritz it a little bit with a, like a spray bottle. effect so it's going I think these will survive honestly not sure about that first one bring them over to see the original graft? Sure. Right here, this was a sucker of the old apple tree. It's a red apple and I grafted my dad's apple on this and it's a green apple. Very tasty. Cool. And those are the starts that we transferred over to the other two. Awesome. So, let me know if you need any help.